Alright, how's everyone doing today? As always, I'm Epic Luca, and I'm playing Joe and Matt Caveman Ninja on the Genesis Flashback. Now, you may be wondering, why am I doing this when we just did a bunch of these episodes for the arcade? Well, simply put, and I'm gonna... Yeah, may as well just start the game while doing this, because it's a more casual Let's Play than the other ones I've done. But the only reason I, I'm doing this is because after we had played through it a little bit, I finally figured out something... <laughs> <laughs> and that's still funny as shit. But no, I figured out something that would that would help me actually beat this game, which involves if you hold the attack button, you could throw bigger weapons. I didn't know. I didn't. I, di I know not what I did. I wish I had. That would have helped. That actually helps a lot in boss fights. I don't, I don't do it on the uh, regular levels in general, because I don't know if it helps enough to justify it, but yeah, bastard. Well, good thing they're generous with health, too, because all this food stuff you see, the cupcakes and, you know, the cupcakes and soda, all this fun stuff, it's, it's health, and I hate you guys. No, stop it. Get away from me. Mm, I can grab that for now. Not like I need it or anything. Whoops. Ow. Well, that's not good. Whoop. Ah, this is definitely no good. No bueno. No Kinder Bueno today. But you noticed I threw a giant one at his head, and it ended up being... It ended up taking out a full bar of health, which is... So, I wish I had known. Also, don't want to get too close to him, because you've seen he will... <coughs> he will hit you with his tail. Which is why I'm trying to find the picture-perfect spot to stand in. But no, I mean, he's not a hard boss anyways. I just got hit because I'm stupid. But then, here, eat these, eat these tires. But no, that wasn't hard, though. And the good thing is, we get our health back. Everything after this is a mixture of being both a little too easy and a little too hard. That's convenient, though, that the second player can jump in at any time. That'd be, like, that'd be bullshit if he just ended up getting to jump in with me, like, right, right at this point, like, or even later on, like I've done. And crap, I didn't want that. I mean, I guess no harm, no foul, I'll end up getting some... Yeah, I'll get my fire back. <clears throat> and get out of here, you stupid fish. And you get out of here too, I don't... <sighs> Fine, I will smash your eggs. I don't even get points for it. What the... Wow. Oh my god, this is gonna be a problem. Damn it! Okay, I suck. Come on. Like, I'm sucking. Damn it. Okay, that was my fault. That was definitely my fault. Good thing is, at least I believe you have a boomerang. Well, you know what? And that's fine. <coughs> that's fine. Because, yeah, it doesn't matter what weapon... You I can't believe I died. I was hoping to have done this without dying, but... Hey, I'm not perfect. In fact, I kind of suck. But, hey, that's besides the point. It's like the one guy when we were playing Death... What?! Those can actually hit you when he dies? Wow! I call shenanigans. That's complete bullshit. But it's like the guy who commented when we were playing that junior he's like you guys suck at this game it's like we've never played it you dick <coughs> okay the fire would have actually been not an arrowhead that will never be helpful to my knowledge although it will be help it would be helpful if all these guys would just move 
Oh, like that. And damn it, I... And this is why the arrowhead is like the shittiest weapon in existence. Oh my god, that... I don't know if that would have killed me, but I have this feeling probably... Okay, is this a better weapon than this shitty thing? Thank you, I'll take it. Okay. I'm like, hello. Oh, and I... Huh, I didn't think I'd actually hit him there. But yeah, if you take out a bar of his health, he does that stupid dive bomb attack. We didn't... We thought it was more random than that, but it is not. Although, yeah, he also gets a little bit crazier with the eggs. But no, he's... He's not an overly hard boss. Once you know what to do, a lot of these bosses, like, it's a case of knowing their patterns. That plant thing, his shit's a little more... A little more random, but no, still not hard. This is, to me, is probably the, funny enough, the hardest boss fight in the game. Stupid fish. And I believe the water spurts can hurt you funny enough. It's like everything can fucking hurt you. Even the birds, even the pterodactyls, like every little thing can hurt you. No, I don't want that. I definitely do not want that. Oh no, I and I know falling here, I, I'm trying to think, falling maybe doesn't kill you, I think maybe it just hurts, hurts you. But yeah, I hate, I hate this level, like this is the worst. Oh, this whole, actually both these next two sections. Damn it, you can't even jump on them. I hate this. I hate these stupid things. I mean, I'm doing pretty okay. Come on. fish and now I gotta good <sighs> and yeah we rescue her fortunately enough <clears throat> and this is one of those cases where I've noticed the trend is that B is almost always easier than A this is well I guess both sections are not terribly hard I just like this one better because it's you know the other one is that Nessie thing. I think we've I think we did that like the first time we whoops and I will take this. Ah, so much stuff. No. I mean the good thing is there's so much food left behind when you kill them too, but No, ah, oh, no, these stupid things. Damn it, and the food went away. And it's weird Nessie creature thing. I don't know why. I mean, she's, again, not... Sort of not hard. Sort of. Except when shit like that happens. No! And now I'm dead. I hate that. Okay, this might be one of my least favorite boss fights, too. Just because of the range in which she can... And I wish you could jump more when charging your weapon, but you cannot. Hell, maybe if I just stay over here and try and dodge her stupid fish. And even then... Even then it doesn't work. <sighs> Come on, we're doing good. Kinda, sorta. Oh man! I also don't like that... I also don't like that you can't really do any... Come on. 
Almost there. We're doing good. Honestly, I should have known I would die, you know, a few times. I'm not perfect at this game. I didn't play it growing up. I played it a little bit on the NES later, but I didn't get past that stupid plant boss. Here I actually feel like I'm doing better. But I mean, I'm making... And hey, I'm making good progress. That's the important thing. I... I wish you got extra lives for some of the points you earn, because it seems like the points are kind of useless for the most part. But No, sir. Not this time. Not today, sir. And fire, and giant boulders, and more giant boulders. And stuff, and bats, and stuff, and I'm not... No, sir, I'm not... No, sir, I'm not touching it. No, sir, I don't like it. La da dee da da dee da dee da dee da. You're gonna leap, aren't? It's like I don't trust you. Although I probably should have grabbed that fire. That might have actually been helpful. Arrowheads will never be. Whoop! How I made it out of that without taking a hit, I'll never know. Hmm. I suppose a boomerang is better than nothing. You get the whole lot of nothing. Uh, yeah, I will take this. Because maybe, maybe this will help. I'll admit, one of my least, another one of my least favorite bosses. Is there a boss you do like? Like, no, not really. I mean, some I some I like and dislike more than others. Like this one, for example. Come on. It's like I know you want to do it. It's like I know you want to come back. See, dodging that, dodging his rolling attack is easy enough. I I just don't like his stupid throwing projectiles attack at me. I mean, again, he's not... He's not a hard boss when you know what to do and when you know to use the stupid charge attack. And this boss is just a pain, pain in the ass any way you look at it. Well, either way, we're fine. I mean, at least there's plenty of foodstuffs to get, like... And that sucks, that right after one boss, you're gonna fight another one and not get a health refill. Like, that's... that shit. Also, don't like that when you're by yourself... Oh, whoop, whoop, nope. Oh, and that was a lucky throw. Come on, kill him. What, do I have to hit him in the head? Apparently I do. Okay, that boss usually gives me a whole lot more grief than that. I am so happy I managed to beat him. I think from here the game doesn't get... I mean, the game's almost over, too. That's the thing. It's a short game. It's a really short game. Which is why I felt justified in doing a bonus Let's Play. And I will tell you this. I'm gonna do one more arcade episode with Eve regarding this. Simply because, well, A, because I can. It's our channel. We can do whatever the hell we want. And B, I want to sh show her this thing that I've discovered. And come on! Quit using the bone as a shield, you dick. Uh, yes. Yes. I will buy what you are selling. But yeah, I want to show her this freak. Because you guys saw we were struggling with some of those bosses more so than others. Having this stupid. Like, this thing is just cheap! Really, and I hit him. You saw I hit him.
Oh, come on! Thank you. Oh, no, wait, there's a little bit more after this. I, I forgot there's, like, one... Ow. Oh, come on! What, do I just have to stay back and just do this? And keep getting hit? And die? <sighs> that did not go as... Oh, great, now I'm stuck with the stupid hammer. No! Although, maybe I can still... Well, like I said, any... It, it's like it doesn't even matter what weapon you have. I don't, I don't like his sporadic attack pattern, although, shit, I forgot the next boss is probably going to be worse. Haha, <laughs> but... Right in your damn face, son. Yeah. Oh, crap, and I didn't notice I overcharged. Uh, parent, yeah, if you overcharge, you... No! Come on! I hate this boss. Yeah, I hate... Damn it, this is going fantastical. I was doing good up until now. And then I fucked up and continued to die. Good, get down. Come on. I say get down, it's like you ain't dead yet. You know what? Damn, that was a good throw. Seems like it's completely random when he charges, though. Good. But man, two charged hits for his head. That's what made this guy worse, because he seems like he takes more abuse. He has more durability and endurance than the other guys, but, you know, still nothing I can't... Ha! Dick. I definitely don't like how bosses can kill you even after they die, though. Like, his thing... Like, I killed him at the same time, but no, I would... Mm, I think I'll stick with Route B. I'm... Like I said, I think every route B other than the one other than the route that I took with route A, I think is probably the better. Wow, and that was Oof. That was actually pretty beast. And I'm gonna want this, probably. This boss, there's no real it's just all pure dumb luck. Well, a combination of luck, skill, and timing. And seeing as how I'm by myself, it's going to be a lot of... No! Oh, you son of a bitch! Oh no, he knocked me under the arrowhead at the end! Fuck. Oh my god, maybe that... Holy crap, maybe that's actually what I need. Thank you! <laughs> Okay, Arrowhead against the T-Rex is your best friend. I was not aware of this because... I didn't know it had this kind of range. Yeah, cheap as... <laughs> cheap as all fucking hell. Also, ma also on this level, made the, uh, made the joke when we first did it. It's like, it looks like he's going into his mouth. And I told her, and I told her I'm like, I, I was making a joke. I didn't, I didn't mean that he was actually going into his mouth. But no, we are in this thing because... Ow, damn it. No! No, this is going great. This is going fantastical. I hate this guy. I can understand he's tough. Yeah, and I'm dead already. This might be a spot where I may end up having to use the regular jump. I keep forgetting it's a thing. Also, don't attack the heart. It does nothing and... Oh. Also, take your time. Ow. What? I stepped on it.
I hate how finicky the hit boxes on these things are. I mean, I'm doing okay. I mean, I'm doing... Come on, one more hit. One more hit. Oh, you son of a bitch. Thank you. I don't even... Okay, Neanderthal cavemen kidnapped our women. Why are we in a giant dinosaur fighting a weird alien thing? Also, can I hit this still? No. But no, he's the final... He's the final boss in the game. And you know... <clears throat> it's like, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna show... Hmm. What say what? Oh. Apparently, if I don't pick anything, they make... They make the decision for me. I was not aware of this. But I'll... I'll go back, like, I'll show all three endings, but wow, that, that is stupid. Well then, but hey, that's been Joe and Matt Caveman Ninja for the Genesis. Maybe down the line I'll go back for myself and beat the NES version just because I can now. It'll be a little harder, but hey, what can you do? But no, this is a fun game. I like the, I like the humor they have going on. A lot of it doesn't make sense because what is all this modern food and modern technology doing in this game? It makes no sense, but no, it's still a funny ass game though. I, I, I enjoyed it, I'll admit. And hey, another retro game for us to beat, which is pretty cool. I, I don't think I beat enough Genesis games in my time. I only about 40 maybe, which is a lot. <laughs> But no, every ending's just gonna be some stupid thing that ends that way. And yeah, into your... Whoops. Oh, do I have to hit space then? Yes, apparently I have... And there's a timer on entering that, that's stupid. But, hey, that's been... That's been Joe and Matt Caveman Ninja for the Genesis. Hope you enjoyed the bonus Let's Play, and... Yeah, that's pretty much it, so hope you all enjoyed. And until the next one, as always, thanks for watching.